Vermiculite and its unique properties were known as early as 1824, when Thomas H. Webb experimented with it in Worcester, Massachusetts. It was Webb who gave the mineral its fanciful name because he thought the long strands looked like a mass of small worms. Vermiculite was regarded as not much more than a scientific curiosity until the early 1900s when more practical uses were sought. The first commercial mining effort occurred in 1915 in Colorado. The material was sold as tongue ash, but did not find sufficient buyers, and the venture failed. The first successful vermiculite mine was started by the Zonalite Company in Libby, Montana, in 1923. The mine continued to operate until 1990. The largest vermiculite mining operation in the world is located in the Falabora, also sometimes spelled Palabora, district of the Republic of South Africa. Other countries producing significant amounts of vermiculite include the United States, China, Russia, Brazil, Japan, Zimbabwe, and Australia. In 1999, there were three active vermiculite mining operations in the United States, two in South Carolina and one in Virginia, which shipped concentrated vermiculite ore to exfoliation plants located throughout the country. In addition to using concentrated vermiculite from domestic mining operations, these plants also imported about 77,000 tons, 70,000 metric tons, of concentrated vermiculite from foreign sources, mostly South Africa.